What is up, Aquarius? Let's go ahead and do November's reading. Um, I just want to tap in just to see what's coming to us in November. I've been getting insight, and I'm just ready to go ahead and put the message out, all right? Um, our angel, Michael, I ask that you use me in the highest light, white light as I give a clear and communicative understanding message to Aquarius, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, Spirit Guides, and most importantly, the universe. So let's go ahead and see what the moon... Well, I call these universe cards. <laughs> Even though they got a moon. They got force. Going into November. Going into November. Feel and release. Release all you have accumulated on this journey. And you are the greatest gift. Your life's journey is your masterpiece. So you see how you releasing stuff that you no longer serves you and you're going and you're forming your masterpiece onto the universe. Believe in the power to manifest. Breathe into your creation with existence with you are being called into service. So now y'all see why I've been so heavily on, so heavily on the topic of stepping out into doing what you need to do. Now you see why. Mm -hmm. Hi, yeah. Looking in. The y'all sometimes i don't use the same cards and i have to hunt for them when i do want to use them What else going into November, Holy Spirit? Divine Feminine or Divine Masculine. Transformation is going into November with your soul family. A lot of y'all are going to be awakened with awakening at the bottom of the deck. Something good. To you, say that's the truth. That's the truth. Right now, something good. Door to spirit. Appreciation. One more, please. Goddess of the moon. Things are going to be eliminated to you. Awakening. What's that? Build your own personal light. Ooh, so yes, November ain't playing no games. It's time. It is time, November. Loyal heart. Thinking, overthinking. Building blocks. No place like home. Being a feeling alone and blessed. With Yang at the bottom of the deck. A lot of overthinking is happening at this time. Feeling like you're alone, being alone. Some of y'all may just want to stay in the house and not get out or whatever the case may be. Spirit said no, 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 no. No, no, no. No, 
not this time. All right, for Aquarius, show me what I need to know, not what I need to see for November. Going into November, going into November. So a lot of y'all not going to be in concern about your finances. You do need to, and you're not going to be in concern about your health as well, because your health is going to be on track. You're not going to be in concern about reconciliation as well. Ooh, really? November. You're on a different journey now. Yep. Most of y'all are expecting, whether it's a baby or you're expecting something. Change. Or oh, you may be expecting somebody false around you. The community. So some of y'all may stay in the community or deal with people that's false around you. Or that's not on the same spiritual beliefs as you are. Yep, mature woman, you're getting wise about it. You're no longer in despair about it as well. Yep, you're not considering them people in high honor no more. Most of y'all have paperwork going on. With the mature um, man, and you're not really focused on no man as well with the man in reverse. Um, This could be considered a karmic. This can also be said you're putting yourself first. So you don't want to go backwards, okay? Oh, I'm tripping, y'all. Hmm. to November. Great fortune. Great fortune is the compass. So yeah, you're getting to the bag. That's why you're not worried about it. Um, You're not even concerned it um, because you're not even concerned at this time because you know luck is on your side. With the coffin card in reverse. Somebody that you thought was. Or maybe this could just be you getting your health right. Sorry y'all. Putting it into stuff that doesn't concern you. It's funny how these two came out on reconciliation. Which is the tower card and the commitment ring. Journey. Journey card, you're not um, hard looking. Uh -oh. Journey card, you're not really searching for any answers. You're just going along with the flow. Expectation. Expectation is a lot of people are not expecting you to cut this shit off, but you are a false person. These people are hating because they're not upgrading themselves. Community card. Community card is a man in the reverse. So this person may not want to be the, for the community no more. <laughs> Pathway. You know the person ain't going to change still. So you're not worried about it. Or if spirit can't send you somebody that's loyal, you're not worried about it. High honor. High honor is the two of um, swans in reverse. Message with the bridge and the uh, still don't want to tell you what's up. Courthouse. Somebody is watching you. Mailman. 
Well, but this could just be paperwork that you're waiting on as well. I don't want to say the feds watching you. Somebody don't want to be sneaky no more, mature. Mature woman, because you know there's snakes around and you don't have time for that burden. Something may happen in November. Your wishes are going to get fulfilled, but somebody's going to try to come in and disrupt your peace because they feel like you didn't choose them or you just can't make a choice. Look. Like you're gambling them with the loyal card. They know time is running out. Somebody may even try to start like some type of chaos, like a fight. Somebody may be, you know, just drama or whatever. Um, don't feed into that. What's going on with this drama? Because they're not having money and they see that you're in, you're not poverty. Somebody may try to start some shit with you because they know that you're working hard. They know that you have a gift. some shit stop thinking that you don't have great fortune as long as you think it, it's going to come in reverse if you're thinking that you know you don't have enough money for stuff you can manifest that way too not only can you manifest good things you can manifest bad things as well because the universe here is everything November. Show me what I need to know, not what I need to see. These cards are so thick. Judgment. This may be you putting judgment on yourself or spirit is putting judgment on people that needs to stay away from you. Eight of swords, you're no longer blinded. You see things clearly now. Six of cups is in reverse. Come on, y'all. I'm sorry. All right. Six of Cups, so let that past stuff go, y'all. Ten of Swords, let that past go. For the month of November. King of Cups with Page of Pentacles. High Priestess in Reverse. Let me do it. No, let me continue. The World Card. Remember I said, let me continue. I was getting ready to stop. I said, let me continue. <laughs> King of Cups, stingy self. High Priestess. Knight of Wands, yep, with the Temperance card. So yeah, Judgment, Eight of Swords, Six of Cups, let that past stuff go. Let any stress that's holding you um, back or whatever the case may be, let it go. Move forward, the Four of Pentacles, the King of Cups, the Knight of Wands, and the High Priestess. Let it go. Because whatever you're looking for is coming. Maybe manifesting this as well. Judgment. Judgment is the strength in reverse. A lot of people that, you know, needs judgment for you, they may be feeling weak at this time. Eight of Swords. Yep, the Queen of Cups. You're taking your emotions back. Six of Cups. 
Yep, no longer visiting the past. Let that shit go. Ten of Wands. Don't go back. Queen of Pentacles. I mean, Four of Pentacles. You're holding on to your bag. The High Priestess is the Four of Pentacles. Wow. Four of Pentacles because you may have gave too much to a situation. You're not doing it no more. Four of Pentacles was in reverse. You got clarity on that shit to not do that anymore. See? Good job, Aquarius. King of Cups. Seven of Cups. Now somebody knows. No. Somebody still don't know. Still don't know what option. While you seeing here Reaper Rewards, you don't have time for that. King of um, the World card, I mean. The word card, you taking a leap of faith. The high priestess with the rewards here card again. Knight of Swords. Get back in here. We don't care about all that extra. The high priestess. High priestess. Saying to yourself, no fast moving. And it's crazy how both of these are like this. The Eight of Wands in reverse and the Nine of Wands in reverse. No fast movement at all. So you could be taking things slow in the month of November. Two of Cups. Yep. So if you do start talking to somebody, you're not um, rushing it. You're not rushing it. You're taking it slow. And you're going to tell that person, you know, I don't want to rush into things with the tempers here. Yep. You don't want no conflict. You don't want no conflict either. Mm -hmm. Everyone falls in love sometimes. Sometimes it's wrong. Sometimes it's right. What is Aquarius money looking like? Oh. You can do the money. Uh -oh. You got your love life and stuff out the way. That's good that you're not doing no fast movement and you're using your intuition on everything. What is the money looking like, Holy Spirit? Ace of Pentacles. Ooh. Mm -mm. Money part. Why you feel like it's the Ten of Cups? Ace of Wands. So you got passion for it. The world card wanted to come out. Maybe that was how you used to feel. The lovers. Or maybe that's what you feel in love. With the two of pentacles. So you're, you don't want to be juggled. Okay, with the ten of wands, no burning. Something for the money spirit though. The hermit card. So during the month of November, you may be with money. Um, you may be approached, Queen of Wands, with the Four of Cups. You may be approached um, with offers, and pretty much you're not taking it. A lot of you may feel like you have a lot on your load right now, so you're just not taking it. Ten of Cups. Yeah, you're in concern. Y'all may be at a point right now to where you are doing things by yourself. So you're in concern right now. What about the Ace of Wands spirit? High honor. The world card. So you could be in high honor on your job or something that you in love doing. Disticarizing the lovers. Message. Four cups. 
coffin. Two of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. Poverty with the courtship. So you could be letting go of a business or jobs that you're doing. You could just be letting them go. Even though you know you're not broke from them. It's just you're just... It's time to just focus on one. You're no longer letting your mind be imprisonment on decisions. This is the money portion. Unfortunately, this is how it's coming out. Sorry, y'all. The Hermit card. Um, the Hermit card is bad health. So you're no longer stressing on things. It's none of your concern. Page of Wands. Mature woman. So somebody is immature around you. Queen of Wands. And you're not even in thoughts. Unexpected income is at the bottom of the deck as well. With sudden wealth. So yeah, get out that mindset, Aquarius. This is not the vision that I had. I don't know <laughs> what went left. But get out that mindset, Sugarfoots. Get out that mindset that things are not coming to you. Okay? Try from a different spread, real quick. <laughs> Aquarius money part, Holy Spirit. Here go the Ace of Pentacles again with the High Priestess. Money portion. Nine of Cups. So a lot of y'all gonna have a lot of offers coming in Nine of Pentacles. Yes, Aquarius. You gotta get out this mindset, honey. The sun card with the nine of wands. Why y'all feel like y'all don't have enough? The Ace of Wands. Here go the World card again, y'all. Remember, this is y'all past feeling. That's why I didn't want to do this read right now. With Unbalanced, I wanted to do it once November hit. This may be how you're feeling now. Nine of Cups. Concern again. Nine of Pentacles. A challenge with the Tower card. Ten of Pentacles. Good luck is coming to you. You put an answer to something and luck is coming to you. The sun card. Yep, don't think that you didn't make the right choice. King of, King of Swords. Somebody is fucking with you. Somebody is in your head. Ace of Wands. Get your chakras online because it seems like y'all are. King of Cups. The Snake card. World card spirit. Tempers. Clarify. Somebody. Ooh. Seven of Pentacles. Y'all, somebody is messing with your head. 
because they want a commitment with you. It don't mean, a, it don't have to be a love commitment. It could just be any type of commitment. Somebody is hating on your shine. They don't even want your wishes being fulfilled. Both of them came out in reverse. Somebody want to stop your finances. I don't know who y'all have around y'all. Tell me more. Ace of Swords. Because they don't have truth and understanding. Five of Cups, because you you you're moving on with the leap of faith. Queen of Pentacles. You're not giving out handouts. They're going through a tower moment. Ace of Pentacles. Eight of Swords, they're reflecting on what's, you know, what's done to you. Five of Pentacles with the Ace of Cups. Because you took your love back. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was just trying to get the message out. Because you took your love back, somebody feels some type of way. When Spirit was trying to give you somebody, you took your love back and they feel some type of way. Because I'm tired of mentioning a karmic. Somebody that's, you know, low vibration, low vibrational, you know. They don't want the cycle to end. That's why the world card came out on both decks. Wow. See why I was like, I didn't want to do a November read until now. You see what I'm saying? Until November, the energy is so dark right now. And they people don't want to see you. They don't want to see you shine. I'm going to leave it at that. What's the advice, angels? Get more information on anything that you're doing. Spirit say no, it's not going to work, whatever they're trying to do. Be assertive. And yes, it is going to work. Whatever these people are trying to do, it's not going to work. It is going to work. Well, yes. Helpful people is in reverse. I don't take these in reverse. But if anybody is coming to you asking you, oh, I can help you do this. I can help you do that. And that's why people, false people are around you. Let me go ahead and get this message out. I love y'all because you got opportunities coming. I love y'all until next time. Wishing you peace, love, and light. Namaste, y'all.